Princess Chris Jackson explained that Queen can go whole event without smiling. Meanwhile, Prince Harry's affectionate nature can make it hard to capture faces. Chris hopes to photograph Harry and Meghan leaving St George's Chapel in May. He's captured dozens of special royal moments over the years, from Kate and William's wedding day to Harry and Meghan's more recent engagement announcement. But now, S royal photographer Chris Jackson has why members of the royal family don't always make his job easy, in particular, Her Majesty the Queen. The 38-year-old, who is married to the Duchess of Cambridge's stylist Natasha Archer, explained how the 91-year-old monarch can go a whole event where she's not smiling, making it hard to get that money shot. Meanwhile, touchy-feely Prince Harry's love of hugging is not always a good thing from Chris's point of view, as it makes it trickier for the photographer to capture people's faces. Speaking in an interview with The Huffington Post, the photographer explained how getting a good picture can often be down to luck, although members of the royal family can sometimes make his life more difficult. Discussing photographing the Queen at official engagements, Chris said, she's not always smiling. In fact, you can go a whole event where she's not smiling. She doesn't always make it easy for you but I like that. He said that recently engaged Harry, 33, meanwhile can also be tricky to photograph due to how touchy-feely he is. He's a big hugger, wherever he goes. You have to be quick off the draw to capture those, Chris explained. They're all wonderful and lovely but you do have to be able to see people's faces a bit. Chris also added that he is looking forward to photographing Harry and Meghan on their wedding day in May, explaining how he hopes to capture the moment they leave St George's Chapel as husband and wife. The photographer, who has been capturing members of the royal family for nearly 14 years, previously got the money shot of Kate and William leaving Westminster Abbey back in 2011. Earlier this year, Chris's favourite royal photographs from last year, which included Prince George's first day at school in September. Speaking about capturing the special moment, he told Female, It was one of my favourite photos I've taken this year, and very special to have been asked to take it. The first day of school is a big moment for both parents and children alike and it was great to see little Prince George with such a big smile on his face as he stood next to his father, the Duke of Cambridge ahead of their first school run together. He added, My favourite story of recent weeks was that Prince George had played the sheep in the school nativity play, I bet he enjoyed it. <laughs>